Happy Wednesday, you guys. At the gym, getting it in. <laughs> getting it in at the gym, y'all. Hope you guys are working out today. If not, go get it, y'all. It's never too late. Get your workout in. Make it a lifestyle, y'all. Have a blessed and safe Wednesday. Yeah, I don't want to get all like that. Yeah, you should. Just finished up an amazing workout. Yes. Wednesday workout. Yes. Second day with my Paisley. Woo. Yes. That means we working hard. Can we get a donut? Now? Summertime oh. fine. Because it's about, let's get donuts. hot out here, y'all. It's already hot. Summertime in AZ already. Our Cali folks, y'all bless. We about to get this heat crazy right now. About to go home and get freshened up so we can get sweaty again. <laughs> yeah, so, but yep. Amazing workout with my Paisley. Hungry now, always hungry, y'all. Hungry. I love you, Mom. I love you too. What a fun workout. My twin. Yeah, right. so, to y'all soon. Hey, YouTube family. So this is hours later after you've seen me and Paisley at the gym working out. I had to go to the grocery store and get something for dinner. I decided to get some hamburgers and french fries for dinner tonight. So that's what we're gonna have for dinner tonight. Something quick and easy. It is getting really, really warm out here, you guys. I think that Wednesday, which is today and Thursday, or Thursday and Friday, we're supposed to get as high as 104 or 105. So when the weather starts getting like that, I really don't wanna cook things that have the oven on too long or that I have to be in the kitchen sweating too long or having the heat on. In the, in the house too much and try to find quick meals to eat that are good. And when you have children, it's really, really easy to please them because kids like hamburgers and french fries and chicken nuggets and, you know, chicken strips and burritos, tacos, things like that. You know, kids love that kind of stuff. And that stuff is easy and it's cheap. Also, I was thinking about making spaghetti. I might make a pot of spaghetti tomorrow because that always stretches and everyone loves that. Also, I got Adrian, he's asleep. He kind of came in with a little attitude today. So he wanted to get dropped off, but you know, I'm on a tight schedule. I have two other children to pick up and I don't want to be double backing and wasting gas. Um, so, or I don't want to be late also beating this school traffic with all these parents in the line to pick up our kids so I just rather stay on schedule unless it's an emergency but yeah so I was in the store shopping today and I saw I wanted I had a taste for a coffee I haven't had in a little while and I was looking around and they had this Starbucks made a new drink And it's a uh, cold brew coffee and it has cocoa and honey in it with cream and it's really really good guys like I was shocked and it was on sale I think it was um, 125 uh, on sale today and it's a new item so that's surprising that's why I tried it because I didn't want to spend a lot of money on any coffee so I decided to go ahead and try that and it's not that bad um, so yeah I just thought I would let you guys know what I was drinking today tried something new I'm not real big Starbucks fan like I said I don't go to Starbucks spending five six dollars on one drink I think it's just overrated I think people are just brainwashed into thinking Starbucks is the thing they have so many iced coffees at the grocery store now, guys. So if you really love iced coffee, 
go to Walmart and get some different brands. They have them. Um, you can buy a carton for like $3.99. Sometimes they're $2.99, $2.49 at Winko's right now. Iced coffee, caramel, uh, macchinos. I don't know if I'm saying it right. <laughs> um, they have uh, lattes, all that. And they last longer because you get out of one carton, you get like eight cups of iced coffee and that's cheaper than buying a iced coffee every day at Starbucks so you know if you're like me and you like to save money then you're gonna always look into which way is cheaper but also you can still enjoy the things that you love so yeah um, it's been different because I've been staying with my mom and dad and when I buy my iced coffee my dad likes to drink it up so I haven't really been buying it lately, but um, I don't mind sharing. It's just that he gets a little happy with it. So I just decided to kind of cut back on it. And also, I just didn't want to buy it anymore because whenever I have a taste for it, I want to have it. So, but I've been really, really working out hard. I'm really trying to lose a few pounds before the summer really, really hits here. I mean, we'll officially be in the summer. I think we are officially in the summer here in Arizona. But to me, since I'm from Cali, I always think summer starts in June. Boy, do I miss California weather. I miss the beaches. Um, it's just beautiful there. It's just beautiful. Um, I just have never really felt like an Arizona. Uh, you know Arizona and I just I don't know I just don't feel like I fit in here <laughs> but um, I'm making the best of it and my children seem to be very happy so that's what matters to me like I've always said but yeah I'm just in the um, the parent uh, drive up line to pick up Princess Paris um, and while I'm waiting I'm just up here snacking on some pretzels I didn't get a chance to eat today, which is not good because I bought a salad and I didn't even get to eat it. So I'm going to have to wait till I get back home, which is going to be after four o'clock before I get to actually eat my first meal. And it's only barely three o'clock right now. So yeah, I hope you guys are having a blessed Wednesday. I'm so grateful that we're in the middle of the week and looking forward to the weekend. I don't have any plans made for this weekend, but it's always nice when the weekend comes so you can be on your own schedule and not worry about getting up super early for school or work and things like that unless you work on the weekends. So yeah, I've been having a really good time hanging out with my daughter Paisley, working out. I think my mother's going to be back tomorrow at the gym. I think she's really anxious to get back in the gym tomorrow. So we'll see, y'all. We'll see. You stay tuned till tomorrow's vlog and you'll see who is going to be working out with me at the gym tomorrow. So, yeah. Hey, guys. So, you know, I was telling you guys about this new coffee that I was trying today. It was on sale at Safeway for a dollar twenty-five. I just got a chance to drink it, and it tastes good when you're drinking it, but the aftertaste is awful. It leaves a nasty, nasty strong coffee taste in your mouth. Unless you really, really love coffee, I don't think you'll like it. I will not be buying this again. Um, sometimes you got to try stuff just to find out if you like it and I don't care for this so I wouldn't buy this again but you know you can try it see if you like it some people are very in love with coffee and they love that coffee taste but I don't like the aftertaste that it's leaving in my mouth Ugh. I'm used to caramel I usually don't even drink anything coffee without caramel in it so, yeah, but I just wanted to try something different today. So, yeah, looks like the parent line is about to start moving now. Um, I think baby girl is about to come out in the next five minutes or so. So, 
yeah we just sitting in here with the AC blowing because it's way too hot right now to have the windows down and it just gets hotter and hotter as time goes on in Arizona isn't that crazy crazy Got my princess Perry. <laughs> oh, well, guys, I guess I was wrong. Adrian had swimming today in PE in his last period, and now his asthma is acting up and he doesn't feel well. So I have to swing back home and take him home so he can get a treatment. You know, the life of an asthma kid and a life of an asthma mother of three asthmatics. Um, it's very scary, you know, trying to make decisions and doing the right thing to make sure your children stay healthy and not end up in the hospital. So, yeah, that's where we are. We're headed into the house so that he can get his treatment and to make sure that my son is feeling okay. So we're back at the house now. Gonna handle that. Got Andrew. Got all my babies now. Where are we headed into? Headed into Walgreens to look for the spinner. That spinner craze is still in, y'all. So yeah. That we stop over here and see what's going on and also y'all my mom and dad's water thing is not working so now we got to go buy some bottled water so while we're in the Walgreens I guess I'll just look and see if they got some water jugs in here for cheap hopefully they do but Walgreens and CVS they them kind of stores that they be trying to charge you high class prices for the littlest things. I, I really don't like shopping at these kind of stores because they're way too expensive. So yeah, but we're gonna go in here and see what's up. All right, peace. Andrew. Hi. <laughs> Walking in the Walgreens and throw this in the trash. Real quicky quick. Back in my summer dresses, y'all. It's weird. I haven't worn summer dress in so long. Mm, summer dresses. It's kind of crazy. What's the matter? Huh? Walking around in Walgreens. Walgreens. It's one of the stores we don't hardly ever go to. <laughs> Beauty. No. We, oh, look at we up on the big mirror and everything. <laughs> Auntie? Yeah. Hi. <laughs> That's my handsome. Mm, you always look good. Yeah, so we're in here looking for spinners. We don't know. Might have to ask somebody. Might have to ask somebody, though. Hmm. Is this a little clearance thing? Y'all know. How do I? Oh, it's just like I smell the clearance rack, y'all. That is so funny. What they got? Ooh, they got a Nutra Boss Blender 15 piece set. That's dope. I need that. See that, y'all? I need that. Yeah. Let me see. Put us in here. <laughs> Ooh. Look what they got for men's. For men that want that V, that V cut down there. <laughs> That's funny. I didn't know they had one of these for men. Men, do you guys use this? Comment below if you use this or do you just work out and get your natural V on your own? Wow. I don't. It said get a V shape in seconds. One training belt. Ah. V shape ah. in seconds. Look at That's comedy. Wow. 
I guess men need it just like women do. Women use waist trainers, so I guess men use them too. More power to the men getting a waist and getting a V shape. Hey. Well, right now we ain't had no luck on that uh, finding the spinners. We might have to ask, or they might not have any more in here. Feels nice in here, y'all, because it is really hot outside. Don't y'all just love body sprays? I love body sprays. They got some good. I'm sorry, but my allergies are acting up so much lately. My nose is probably looking crazy and doing my nose all crazy. But I used to, I used to wear this, y'all. Sunflowers. It smells so good. I might have to get back into wearing this again. And you know what? I love sunflowers. My whole house used to be decorated with sunflowers. I can't wait to get my sunflower stuff out again. But yeah, they got some. They got all kinds of body spray. Oh, look at it, Paris. That smells good. Fancy. I'm coming. Mm, Jessica Samson. All right, my son said I'm stopping too much. I gotta go with him. I gotta go. Get this online. Y'all know how much I love my snacks and my candy. Look at Starburst, all pink edition. Oh my God. And look at the Skittles, y'all. Bright side. And the Skittles, bright side. This is all new stuff right here. New, 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 new. Comment below if you guys have tried this before. Y'all know I'm about to try these. I don't know if I'm gonna get them today, but. Yes, let me see. I think we're gonna get these at, um, what do you call it? At Walmart, I think they'll be cheaper at Walmart. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think that's worth 59 cents. Yeah, but I'm hyped. Got some new candy to try, y'all. Yeah. We got to get back soon because I got to go check check on my son, Adrian. He was on the asthma machine before we left, so yeah, I got to make sure he's okay. Yeah, I think we have to. Hey y'all, so we're back home and I just finished up dinner. There's hamburgers and french fries. Turkey burgers y'all, because like I told you, I don't really eat red meat hardly ever. Sometimes when I eat out, I'll get a burger. But when I cook at home, I always make turkey and chicken and fish. So yeah, this is what we're having tonight. Turkey burgers with fries and um, I'm just going to go ahead and end the night and end this vlog because I'm kind of tired today and I don't have anything else planned to do today. But I hope you guys had a blessed and safe Wednesday and I hope that you're at home, cozied up with your family, is um, enjoying some dinner wherever you are and we will talk to you guys tomorrow. God bless and peace.